Hey everyone, I'm Cheyenne and today we want to check out one of the fastest keyboard made by Razer and it is the Razer Huntsman Tournament Edition. As you know, the Tournament Edition series in Razer keyboards is stand for compact without numpads and being the TKL layer like this one. And I really like the TKL keyboard because it's lighter than the full size keyboard and you know it's really easy for travel. You just unplug it and put it in your backpack. But this keyboard is not that compact. It's 80% and if you're looking for the super compact keyboards, you should probably check the Razer Huntsman Mini or the DocuVan and check the Amazon link on the description. So let's talk about design and build quality. The frame is mainly plastic with a thin aluminum top plate. It's matte black so there is no fingerprints and that's a good one. One of the coolest design in here is the removable cable. This wired cable is simply removable and is type C to type A port. For gamers, by gamers. You saw that on an unboxing video, right? You won't see it very often. But it does look nice with contrast of gloss on a matte finish. The weight of this keyboard is 1.54 pounds or should I say 0.7 kilogram or 700 grams maybe? Is that okay? Now here's the good part. The Razer Huntsman TE features the Razer Liner Switch. A switch that activated by light instead of relying on metal leaves to make a contact. The Huntsman TE only comes with liner variant of Razer optical switch. This switch is exceptionally smooth. The liner switch is the best version of the Razer optical switches. The stabilizers are decent and the keys feel very light and super sensitive. So if you're looking for tactile or clicky, you're going to have to look another keyboard. Because the liner switch is a very fast keyboard with an actuation point near the very top at 1 millisecond. It is half of the Cherry MX switches, so yeah, it's very fast. And when you try it, you definitely notice the speed and how lightly you can type with this keyboard. These switches are great for gaming, but you have to be very careful. Because as I said, it's super sensitive. I don't want to lie about it, but it took me a while to get used to it. And now I can't use any other keyboard, so yeah. Razer used the double shot PBT keycaps on this keyboard. So what is PBT keycaps and what's the difference between PBT and ABS? PBT is usually more expensive than ABS because they feel better and PBT doesn't discolor or develop shine over the time. Some people say the PBT keycaps are better to showing the RGB backlighting. But I really think it's your choice and it's up to you. You can choose the shiny ABS or the matte PBT. The stem of the switch is still compatible with all Cherry MX keycaps, allowing you to put whatever set of keycaps you like on this keyboard. The keyboard is reasonably ergonomic. It is great on typing or gaming, although it has fairly high profile. It doesn't come with wrist rest, but if you really want it, you can get it from the Razer website or the Amazon. This keyboard also have a two pin on the back to adjust the incline. Usually a flatter or even inverted profile is considered more ergonomic and can help you to prevent the strain injuries. The Huntsman TE is completely packed for RGB lighting and macro keys and you can customize it with Razer Synapse 3 software. All you have to do is just download and install the Razer Synapse 3 which have a multiple effects and you can always customize the color and the speed. And that's how the RGB lightings are when you put out the keycaps and this effect is the audiometer with a little decoy on it. On the other side we have the chroma visualizer which is exactly audio effect on the studio but it has more setting to customize the lighting. Here's the exact custom sets that I'm using right now but which one do you prefer? Let me know in the comments. We also have the hyper shift to set different things for each key and you can set the gaming mode to disable the windows key. The Razer Huntsman Tournament Edition is an outstanding mechanical gaming keyboard. The liner optical switch have an incredibly short pre-travel distance that make it one of the most responsive keyboard I've tested. It might seem a bit expensive but I'm telling you you will never tire of this keyboard, especially on gaming. So here it is, the Razer Huntsman Tournament Edition. 
I hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel. And see you guys on the next video.